Oh, dear. Uh, don't go away, Doctor. My coordinates seem to have slipped a little. Still not bad after 29,000 light years. I do hope you can uh, <laughs> spare a moment or two, Doctor. Sarcasm always was a weak point with you, wasn't it? May I say that I think you look quite ridiculous in those clothes? I am travelling incognito. Oh, why? We Time Lords don't care to be conspicuous. Some of us, that is. Now, look, if you've come down here merely to be rude... I came to warn you. An old acquaintance has arrived on this planet. Huh? One of our people? The Master. That jackanapes, all he ever does is cause trouble. He'll certainly try to kill you, Doctor. The Tribunal thought that you ought to be made aware of your danger. How very kind of them. You are incorrigibly meddlesome, Doctor, but we've always felt that your hearts are in the right places. But be careful. The Master has learnt a great deal since you last met him. I refuse to be worried by a renegade like the Master. He's a... he's an unimaginative plodder. His degree in cosmic science was of a higher class than yours? Yes, well, uh... <clears throat> yes, well, I, I was a late developer. Would you call that little surprise unimaginative? What? Look through the door. But be careful. thing should fall, it'll explode and probably destroy this research center completely. You see, he's rigged it up so that opening the door will make it fall. <laughs> Such an amusing idea. Then you better think of a witty way of dealing with it. Now wait! Oh, good luck. <laughs> 